Good morning and welcome on the Bali 4.4. Brand new Bali launched in 2022 and what a beautiful sunlight in the morning this morning to tour the boat around. Let me give you some numbers first. This boat offers a liveaboard area of 89 square meters. The boat is 13.4 meters long by 7.4 meters wide. It's a great boat with a lot of storage. Light displacement is around 13 tons and you can load over five tons of things, storage, water, and fuel. Let me introduce all this boat to you today. One of the amazing assets of the Bali catamarans is the solid foredeck. Of course, the structural integrity of the boat up front avoids the flexibility of the whole boat and makes the boat more stiff. Second, it's of course a dry area, even at sea with no sprays. Here, around the table, you can be eight people just next to the sink and next to the galley. And of course, a lot of storage. I remind you that we can store on board more than five tons of things. So here, right here, a huge great locker where we can fit either generator or just a big cell locker. I can find right here fresh water or salt water to wash the deck. table is also just removable, easy. And here, because of the solid foredeck, we need to drain the water out in case of big waves. This avoids the water to get inside the boat in case of huge weather. Right here. the access to the gas locker. The solid foredeck enlarges the enjoyable area. So here up front, it's you're safe because you can grab yourself. You got a nice pulpit seat right here and two nice lockers that I will open for you. Right here on the side is a bathroom, uh, shower and toilet for the crew cabin, which is in the other four peak. In the middle of the boat, up front, a great storage for lined or fenders, for example. Right here, the chain locker. with 70 meters of chain, and the windlass can be operated from here or from the helm station. Also from here, you can set up the bridle. The way you access the flybridge from the cockpit is very easy and very safe. You can grab yourself everywhere with solid handrails all around. Helm station on the Bali 4.4 is at mid height. So this gives the possibility to get the boom a little bit lower and enlarge the main sail surface area. Helm station has been designed for two and everything can be handled and controlled from here. Right here on port side, for the halyards and reef lines. Here I've got the engine controls, compass. Here is the windlass control on the chain counter. I've got the electronics, the autopilot, and the other winch is for all the other sheets. As you can see, the boom is low on this Bali 4.4. So the sail 
is reachable, the lazy bag is reachable, it's easy to operate, well, easy access. Right in front of me, the flybridge, where eight people can sit easily, next to the helm station so you're not disconnected with the crew or the captain, and of course, a wonderful sunbed area at the back surrounded by the solar panels. Here on starboard, we got a very nice locker where we can put a lot of storage like the toys, for example. On this side as well, on starboard, we got the bilge pump, of course, for starboard hull. The natural air ventilation intake for the engine room and the davit controls for the dinghy at the back. And the engine room, huge engine whoop. Bali catamarans also offer the walk-around system. That means that you can jump from one hull to the other without getting back into the cockpit. On starboard, we got this locker to plug in and to hide the power cord. Very practical. Walk-around system, the davit system. On the other side, we got the bathing ladder. On port side, we got shower with hot and cold water when you get out of the swim. The natural ventilation with the air intake for the engine room and the manual bilge pump also for the port hull. Right here on the side, we got the grill operated with gas. The amazing concept of Bali catamarans sits in the fact that there is no midship bulkhead and the aft lounge is in fact connected with the interior with the saloon inside the boat. In order to avoid the water getting into the boat, there is a great drainage in between the hulls right here in the cockpit. This aft lounge that can welcome up to six people has also a great storage with a wonderful locker right here with a great access also to the life raft that can be operated with release handles from here. And in case of bad weather, the Bali tilting door can be easily operated, keeping the original volume inside. The Bali tilting door has to be secured when it's closed with two pins on the top and two big handles at the bottom. Having no separation in the middle of the boat, in fact, gives the possibility to get a great table where eight people can sit around. Plus three on the couch, just facing the dining area and the aft bench, it's almost around 15 people that can enjoy together the back of the boat. Lateral sliding base can be operated in three and accelerate naturally the air ventilation throughout the boat. On most of the Bali catamarans, we're able to put a house fridge with decent size for fridge, great freezer as well, but also cold water and ice maker. This decent size galley offers plenty of storages under the floor, under the huge countertop where you can prepare meal, and this one offers also a microwave oven. What I love with this galley, it's because it's facing the sea. So when you're at sea and the underway, I mean, you can wash dishes, you can cook, and still being connected with the rest of the crew inside the boat. Of course, this galley offers a lot of storages again, the gas oven, and a wonderful stove for four pots. Chat tables on Bali catamarans are always connected, and all areas, in fact, are always connected with the salon, and right here, the chat table is also connected with the forward cockpit, offering a great 360 degrees visibility. So here we have an inverter to give uh, uh, 220 volt power on board. This is the 
uh, system and liquid system management with the fuel, the level of fuel, the level of water, and also the level of black water tanks. Here are the light systems, but also electronics and davit systems, uh, winches, all the controls here. Hi-Fi, VHF, chart plotter, and the automatic pilot. The owner's cabin on port side proposes a queen-size bed. On both sides, under the steps, storage. Under the bed, a drawer with more storage. And even further down, under the bed, again, some more storages. In the master cabin, we have two nice wild ropes, many deep cupboards, a nice makeup table and a full-size mirror. The owner's bathroom is well ventilated and has a great size shower up front. A lot of cupboards, double sinks, toilets and you can also fit a washer and dryer. Thank you for visiting the Bali 4.4 and hope to see you very soon on one of the next boat shows.